setting up scan to mailbox. Let's set up scan to mailbox. To get started, I've already entered in the IP address of our printer and I've logged in as admin. We simply click on property. We come over here to services and then we come down and we click on scan to mailbox. By default, scan to mailbox is disabled. So the first thing we need to do is click on enable scan to mailbox. And from here, we'll click on apply. And as we can see, scan to mailbox is now enabled. If we click on capacity, this will show us how much space we have. So currently we've got just over 27 gig of capacity. We've used a gig and a half. Those must be system files because we don't have anything in our mailbox. So we've got available almost 26 gig. That's a lots of space. The next item is files. Here is where we can do some maintenance as an administrator. So we can delete all files now. We can also delete files older than however many days we want to specify. We could say seven days. And we can also schedule a cleanup. So automatically public folder contents will be deleted after you know so many days, maybe eight days. If we come down here to folders, we can, here we can see a list of the folders that we currently have. However, in our case, we haven't created any folders yet. To do that, we click on the Scan tab, and then right here it says Create Folder. Uh, by the way, by default, it comes up under Mailbox. We want to make sure Mailbox is selected so we can say Create Folder. So we're going to do that right now. We're going to give the folder a name. We'll call it Susan. And we'll give the folder a password nice and short one. We click on Apply, and now we have one folder called Susan, which is private. Now let's go back to the properties tab and now under the folders area we can select a specific folder in our case Susan which we just created. We can change the password or we can delete the folder. Moving on to scan policies here we can specify some of the scanning policies like being able to scan to the default public folder requiring passwords etc. And that's how we create a folder for scan to mailbox.